coming up next, a UFC lightweight division bout. With self-belief for days, here is the notorious Conor McGregor, simultaneous two-division champion in the UFC. Nobody has done that before. Probably the best left hand in the game, whether you're a featherweight or a welterweight, you do not want to get hit with that left from the notorious Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan favorite combination. As this guy makes the walk to the octagon, and you can see why if you've watched film on him. This is a true mixed martial artist, plus skills in all areas, and figures to be a handful, really, for anybody in this division. Probably comfortable tonight anywhere the fight goes. Truly a well-rounded MMA fighter. You know, we, we, we trot that term out there a lot. This guy fits the bill. This guy is a very well-rounded fighter. You never know what he's gonna do. His striking is world-class, his ground game is excellent, and he mixes them up very well. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. So more than 10 years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Third round in the UFC lightweight division. It's reducing first. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, three losses. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor McGregor! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 6 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Manila, Philippines, the King! All right, you can lose a lot here. Once you've been in commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. Want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, come back to your corners, come out fighting. All right, here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after it. Uh, you ready? You ready? Let's all go right, the wait is over. We are underway here at the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. So here is Conor McGregor once again. Is there any atmosphere in MMA quite like Conor McGregor fighting in this octagon? The Irish fans are going bananas. We'll see if Conor McGregor can take advantage of what is an obvious edge in reach here tonight. Lands a big right hand early. Oh! So both guys landing at will here. Good action early. Too. Oh, he tagged him in the left. He's got him right here. Back up. Oh. Some more out 
put at least in the early going. How about that shin? Very nice leg kick there by McGregor. Clean punch. Oh, nice straight left. <laughs> Tries a big hook to the head, but misses. Oh, man, with that right leg kick. Oh, he tagged him. This could be oh. it. So, fire a little bit stunned, holding on to him now, not doing a ton, just looking to recover. He transitions to the tie clinch. He blocks the punch. Got one overhook and one underhook here. Tying him up here in the clinch. Now he's got the Muay Thai plum. He got tagged with that uppercut. Oh, oh nice knee! Oh. This could be it right here. Oh! Oh! Beautiful right hook. And now he lost the combination. Back up to his feet. Huge uppercut misses. A huge hook to the head. Another vicious kick from McGregor. Oh, no doubt about it. These leg kicks have been money all night. Attempts a big hook to the head, but misses. Effective with the jab here, Joe. Oh, nice strike landed there by McGregor. He got lit up. Good defense there. Another shot lands upstairs. Leg kick. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Hit him hard with that hook. Oh, he caught him on the body. He's got him right here. Big body shot body. tries to avoid further damage to the midsection moving forward. Nice punch by McGregor. Looking to avoid that left hand. Yeah, he's got it right here. Oh, now. Oh, he's out! Excellent timing here. Big left hand for the victory. Yeah, Joe, just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. Let's look at that from a different angle. And here we see it again. Boom! And that's all she wrote. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mugliata has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 39 seconds of the very first round. Declared the winner by knockout, the no So the notorious Conor McGregor gets it done yet again. There is no doubt his future is in the UFC Hall of Fame, but his present 
is inside this octagon and still getting the job done. Dealt this man at your own peril. It seems no matter the challenge, Conor McGregor finds a way to get the job done, and he did so again tonight. Congratulations to SPG.